All my needed documents for printing are already imported on the print smash app. On the left side, you have options to select or deselect the file that you want to print. Print the selected PDF. The app will ask you for Wi-Fi connection to the multi-function copier. Just go to your Wi-Fi connection settings and select the network name and the password provided by the machine. Once the Wi-Fi connection is established, just tap close and press send. In the copier machine, first select the language and choose English. Select print or scan via smartphone and choose print PDF. So I'm using an iPhone to print my document. So just press next. Once the data reception has been completed, just tap finish and next. The machine will ask you for the type of paper. Tap agree to continue. Once the file is selected to print, just tap next. For the color mode, full color costs higher than the black and white color. And also, the prices vary in the type of paper you will be using. You can preview the scanned image and tap next. The machine will start printing when cash is already inserted in the coin slot. You can put a handful amount of coins if you have lot of documents per printing. That will save you time for inserting coins per printed sheets. Once you're done with printing, you can get the remaining coins by moving the lever beside the coin slot to withdraw the coins. Press Start. The machine starts printing. And voila, you're done. Printing has been completed. Press OK when you're done. If you want to photocopy a document, go back to the main page and choose English as language. Tap one-sided copy. Select the color mode, full color or black and white. I choose black and white. Glossy paper, A4 size is a little bit expensive. You can enlarge or reduce copy by selecting various copies, but I rather keep it as same as the original. Place the document on the copier machine with the blank side as the top position. Tap scan original. And the copier starts scanning the document. The scan image is not at the center, so you can adjust it and repeat the process. Just tap the rescan button and select yes. Just press again the scan original button.
Finally, the scan image is now at the center. So just tap next. Just insert coins and press start. It will cost you 10 yen for one copy. Once the coin is inserted in the coin slot, just press the start button. And the machine will start copying the document. Copying has been completed. Just tap OK to exit the service. We're done. I just repeated the process for my other document. I hope this video helps for you guys living here in Japan. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.